Welcome to class 7 mathematics classes. Today we are going to continue chapter speed, distance and time exercise 12a. Question number 10. A car running at 45 km per hour takes 6 hours to cover a journey. At what speed must, must it travel to complete the journey in 5 hours? Okay. So here speed is given time is given we have to find the distance at first okay and then again we have to determine the speed okay for this time so here given speed is equals to 45 kilometer per hour time is equals to 6 hours so we know distance will be equal to speed into time so here speed given 45 and time 6 distance the unit will be kilometer product of this two is 270 kilometer okay now the distance is 270 kilometer so again we have to take time as 5 hours now time is equals to 5 hours and the speed therefore the speed is equals to the formula distance by time this we know so distance is equals to here to 70 kilometer and time is equals to 5 hours so the speed is 54 kilometer per hour divide this okay to get 54 now here we have calculated first the distance and then the time again okay question number 12 a bus covers 100 km in first 2 hours 64 km in the next 1 hour and 72 km in the next 2 hours find the average speed okay we have to find the average speed of the bus during the whole journey so here average speed is given by total distance by total time okay if we divide the total distance by total time we will get the average speed so here what we have to do is we'll add the total distance covered by the bus okay and the total time taken by the bus to cover the whole journey okay so here distance is equals to 100 kilometer and time taken to cover 100 kilometer is equals to 2 hours okay similarly 64 kilometer is covered in how many hours 1 hour and 72 kilometer covered in 2 hours so total distance is equals to 100 plus 64 plus 72 kilometer which is equals to 236 kilometer and total time is equals to 2 plus 1 plus 2 hour hours okay that is 5 hours now we know average speed is given by total distance by total time so to total distance here is 236 
kilometer and time is 5 hours so when we divide this we will get it as 47.2 kilometer per hour okay question number 15 Raju's school is 4 kilometer away from his house he walks from his house to school and comes back in two whole one by two hours find his average speed so Raju is walking from his house to school and the distance is four kilometer and then comes back comes back that means the distance again is four kilometer so the total distance is four plus four okay that is eight kilometer and he covers the distance in two whole one by two hours that means this is the total time and we have to find the average speed so here distance house to school is equals to four kilometer and school to house is also four kilometer so total distance is equals to 4 plus 4 kilometer that is 8 kilometer okay and total time is given as 2 whole 1 by 2 hours to complete the journey okay 5 by 2 hours 2 2 are 4 4 plus one is five by two hours now average speed is given by therefore average speed is given by total distance by total time so total distance is eight kilometer and total time is five by two okay so here eight into two by five that is sixteen by five is equals to 3.2 and the unit of speed is kilometer an hour so kilometer per hour okay question number 16 find the time taken by a train 150 meter long running at 60 kilometer per hour in crossing a man standing on the platform so here the distance is the length of the train only okay and the speed is 60 km per hour we have to find the time okay taken by the train to cross a man standing on the platform so here the distance will take as the length of the train only so solution distance is equals to length of the train so that is 150 meter okay and the speed is given as 60 kilometer per hour see here this unit is in meter and this one is in kilometer per hour so we'll convert this one into meter per second so 60 into 5 by 18 to convert this kilometer per hour into meter per second so here by 2 nines are 230 okay 3 threes are 310 so here 50 by 3 meter per second is the speed okay now we have to find time so time is given by distance by speed okay so distance is 150 meter and speed is 50 by 3 meter per second so the time we will get in 
second 150 here this three will go up here in numerator 51 ja 53 ja so 3 3 ja 9 second this means the train takes 9 second to cross a man standing on the platform okay question number 18 a train 150 meter long crosses a tree in 6 seconds what is the speed of the train in kilometer per hour so here given is distance is equals to 150 meter and time is equals to 6 second okay so the speed is asked in kilometer per hour therefore speed is equals to distance by time which is equals to 150 meter by 6 seconds so here we will cancel this 3 2 is a 6 3 5 is a 15 and 0 2 1 is a 225 so we have 25 meter per second is the speed now we have to convert this one into kilometer per hour so here if we multiply 25 by 8 by sorry 18 by 5 okay then we'll get speed in kilometer per hour 5 1 ja 5 5 ja so 18 5 ja 90 and unit is kilometer per hour okay question number 19 a train 120 meter long is running at 54 kilometer per hour in how much time will it pass a bridge 180 meter long so here the length of the train is 120 meter and the length of the bridge is 100 meter long so the total distance is the sum of these two and the speed is given as 54 kilometer per hour we have to find the time okay so here solution distance is equals to length of the train plus length of bridge length of the bridge which is equals to length of the train is 120 meter plus length of the breeze is 180 meter sum of these two is 300 meter so the distance is 300 meter and speed is equals to 54 kilometer per hour distance is in meter and speed is in kilometer per hour so let us convert it into meter per second to convert it into meter per second we will multiply this one by 5 by 18 18 1 ja 18 3 ja so 5 3 ja 15 meter per second is the speed of the train now we have to find time time is given by distance by speed so here distance is 300 meter and speed is 15 meter per second so 15 dividing here we get 20 second so time we got as 20 second question number 20 a train 760 meter long crosses a platform 440 meter long in 40 seconds find the speed of the train in kilometer per hour so here length of the train given and the length of the platform given so the total distance that the length will cross is 
the length of the train and the length of the platform time in, time is given as 40 seconds we have to find the speed of the train in kilometer per hour so here solution distance is equals to length of the train plus length of the platform length of the train is given as 760 meter and length of the platform is given as 440 meter okay so the sum of these two is 1200 meter that is the distance and time is given as 40 second so we have to find speed and speed is given as distance by time so here distance is equals to 1200 meter and time is 40 seconds so when we divide it we get it as 30 meter per second but in question it is asked find in kilometer per hour so we have to convert it into kilometer per hour so 30 into 18 by 5 the fraction which will convert meter per second to kilometer per hour 5 ones are 5 six are here 18 six are 108 kilometer per hour thank you very much